I'm excited, I can tell you that. Opening day of deer season here in Minnesota. Very special, we're in a special place. So uh, we've been seeing a lot of big bucks bull hunting. They've eluded us. Uh, we haven't really been able to hunt super, super hard, but enough that, uh, and we've had some chances, but uh, today things are gonna go down. So I heard a rumor that you shot a deer. I just sent you a picture. Oh, I didn't get it. That's not fair. Oh wait, I did get it. No, that's Larry. <laughs> Larry Let me texted call you me. Back. Let me call you back. Wow. Fine. Hey, just so everybody knows, this is the first time that Rachel Wilson from BRP has ever gone deer hunting, and I give her a lot of credit for letting them bucks slide by and waiting for a bigger one. But Kevin Kirkfleet, on the other hand, he saw four or five bucks by nine o'clock in the morning and shot this giant. Boy, Kevin, congratulations on that. Hey, we're gonna be hunting for three or four more days here, so I'm sure Rachel will have another opportunity, and uh, that's the way hunting goes. So hold on to your heinies. Yeah, we did, we got a good one. He's deader than a doornail. Took a couple of shots, but we got him. Let's go get him. Let's get him. Yeah, he come in about 7.30 this morning, uh, had a doe and a young six chasing the doe, and then he came in behind uh, following the two of them and uh, got a 40-yard shot at him broadside. I can't, I can't say enough about these woods down on the southeastern side of uh, Minnesota. It's, this bluff country is unbelievable, and, and to watch the deer and the action we had this morning, um, from the time the sun came up to legal shooting light to the time that this guy went down, uh, it was constant action, so we, we hit it at the right time with uh, the buck rut going on and uh, truly chasing and fighting and, and uh, just a ton of action going on. Well, that was, that's a nice buck. Congratulations on that. That's a great deer. I'd shoot that in a heartbeat. Yep. Hey, I'll tell you the great part too about when you're skinning deer out is make sure you got your tub of towels. Clean up. Just makes life a lot easier, I can tell you that.
Hey, I'll tell you what, Hunter and Rachel weren't seeing a lot, so they decided to get out of the blind and start moving down the ridge. And boy, I'll tell you, they saw this absolutely giant, but she just couldn't get a great shot on it. And that buck walked off and they decided to move down the ridge just a little bit farther and set up again in a little bit different story. So happy, dude. So we're sitting like you are awesome. <laughs> we're sitting on yeah, a rock. So cool. Yeah. I heard you shoot. I was hoping that was you. Oh yeah, he was perfect. Is, yep. Did he get him on camera too? Yeah, Hunter got him. Hunter stopped him oh, like perfectly. Wow. Well, yeah. well, we gotta have a period a period thing for sure. Oh, at least. They started out pretty slow. Uh, we only saw maybe two doe in the morning. And then uh, we decided to take a little little peek over the ridge. We saw two really nice sized buck, one that Hunter's been chasing all week. Um, and then the doe kind of got a little spooked, so we came back up, went to the blind for a little bit, and decided that you know, this is probably going to be our only chance. So we came back around the other side of the hill and uh, sat on a nice rock for, I don't know, maybe an hour. Uh, saw two, two buck walk through, a couple doe back and forth, and then this puppy came. And uh, <laughs> I uh, pulled the trigger twice and it didn't fire. So Hunter had to fix that for me. And third, third time's the charm, right? So. We got her. For first time deer hunting? First time deer hunting. Couldn't be happier. Um, such an adrenaline rush, especially, you know, where we were at in this location is beautiful. It just, I'm, I'm definitely hooked. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Hey guys, it's Mark Minier from Fit and Bone Outfitters. Hey, it's the start of the gun season here in Minnesota, and man, do we got some nice bucks. The weather's been tough, you know, we got some snow, it's been cold out, but man, we were putting some nice gear down. Uh, we got Rachel, she shot a nice 10 pointer. She put a drop on this buck, beautiful. Dan, you got a beautiful eight pointer. Congratulations to him. Uh, we got, I, I believe we're at 12 now for our group, 12 big bucks down. We still got 17 guys out in the field. We got another couple days left. We're gonna start slaying them. Corn's coming down. Can't get any better than this. Hey guys, if you wanna book a hunt with Fin and Bone Outfitters, check us out on social media, Instagram, our website, everything. Uh, take a look at what we got going. We post all our picks, our deers. Check us out at 920-227-3658. You can call or text.